Hi, it's John Settle at Coast Tech again. Today we're going to talk about what your UPS is telling you. So obviously these units have these little indicator lights. <clears throat> and without reading the manual front, uh, cover to cover, let's talk about what they mean. Because they're telling you certain things about the unit. So when you first turn the unit on, what's going to happen is you're going to have the uh, online light is flashing. And it's going to flash for, you know, 10, 15 seconds. And then the unit's going to go to a self-test, where you see right here the little battery light came on. And once the unit has gone through its self-test, it's going to flick back and the online, online battery is going to stay on and lit. And this is your load here. This is how many, this is in, in percentages. Each one of these uh, lights indicates 20% and this is your this is your battery side and again each one of these lights indicates 20% so This is what the unit would look like when it's on battery and over time you would start to see the battery start to drain and It would get to the point where it all starts lighting up then you know you're ready to go down So if you start to load up the unit if you look here in the load graph the loads going up higher and higher if you're loading up the unit too much, when you get to the end, the overload light's gonna come on and it's gonna give you an audible tone. And then if it's on for too long, more than a couple seconds, it's gonna shut the unit back down. So when the replaced battery light is blinking, that means that you wanna get your unit serviced and the battery replaced within about 30 days. So what the UPS is telling you here is that you're in AV trim, which means that the voltage coming into the unit is too high and it's adjusting it down. When it's in AVR boost up here, then the voltage coming into the unit is too low and it's boosting it up to the proper voltage. So all these indications on the UPS are giving you indications of what's going on in your building with your power. And it's not necessarily detrimental always. The UPS is doing its job. You don't have to go out there and get an electrician because your voltage is, is, is fluctuating. As a matter of fact, while we've been filming this here in our studio, these studio lights here have been blinking a little bit, just some flickering. I happen to be very sensitive because I've been doing this for 25 years in this industry. What that's telling me, I'm getting some interruptions in power, very short interruptions. We just had a little brownout right there. The, the, the lights just went dim for a very quick millisecond and they're coming back up. So it's all normal fluctuations of what's going on in your building and the whole reason why you need UPS is to protect your computer equipment. And obviously, if you're still having problems, please give us a call here at Coast Tech. We're here to help you.